Okay, so I wanna tell you about one of my favorite books. Wait, it's not boring, I promise, it's not boring. Just listen. Have I ever let you down? Don't answer that. This book had a massive impact on my professional life when I first graduated from college and it's remained relevant years later. It's called Setting the Table, The Transforming Power of Hospitality. Wait, are you bored already? Oh my God, no, don't get bored. This is such a good book. I'm gonna tell you about it and you're gonna be like, wow, Alexis, thank you so much for telling me about this book. And I'm gonna be like, you're so welcome. And then we're gonna high five. Okay, so Setting the Table is by Danny Meyer, one of New York City's finest and most successful restaurateurs. You might know him as the guy who founded Shake Shack, but I know him as the guy who founded Union Square Hospitality Group, whose 18 restaurants have a combined 28 James Beard Awards and three Michelin stars. This is a photo of Danny Meyer with, <gasps> Me? How did that, wow, that is impressive. We met at a book signing and it's the only time I can remember feeling truly starstruck. I've never seen you lose composure or not be like the perfect presentation when you are meeting someone. So I'm like, great, like she's got this. My friend Sarah came with me for, I don't know, moral support. She also really likes Danny Meyer. I get out there and She literally, I mean, she had to do all the talking. <laughs> and then you very quickly recovered and like we carried on from there. We asked for the autograph. It was perfect. We took a photo. Mm. It's not a photo we've ever taken. <laughs> we did it. I was sweating profusely. It was hot, right? It was summer. It was hot. Summer in New York. It was hot and it was humid. Anyway, eventually I normalized. And then he was like so chill. He was like, oh, that's great. Like, what do you do? And I'm like, oh, I'm an account manager. And it's just like, I use your practices every day. I'm totally an agent. And he signed my book. Do you know what he wrote in the book? In my uh, signature? Right. For Alexis, who knows a thing or two about hospitality, stay passionate. Okay, now that part actually is impressive. I mean, the guy literally wrote the book on hospitality. Come on. Here's why this book has had such a lasting impact on me. In it, Danny Meyer lays out his foundation for how he believes people should be treated. Customers, clients, managers, investors, whatever. He says, Virtually nothing else is as important as how one is made to feel in any business transaction. Hospitality exists when you believe the other person is on your side. The converse is just as true. Hospitality is present when something happens for you. It is absent when something happens to you. Those two simple prepositions, for and to, express it all. He also talks about how staff members behave as either agents or gatekeepers. So you can see how, even though I don't work at a hotel or a restaurant, I've been able to take these principles and apply them to the responsibilities I have had. Originally account management and now business development. I really try to make partners feel like we're all on the same team driving toward the same outcome because that's what we're doing. Oh, and this is all especially important because so much of my professional communication takes place via email, where tone can be so easily misinterpreted. But it doesn't take that long to use a nice greeting, double check for typos, and add a personal touch. On the last page of Setting the Table, it says, our job and our joy is to create restaurants you'd want to return to and to build businesses that ultimately contribute at least as much to their communities as they read from them. To Danny Meyer, a huge thank you. Thank you for writing this book. Thank you for treating people well and creating some of New York City's best restaurants as a result. Full disclosure, I've only been to eight out of the 18, but I'm working on it. And to everyone else, find your heroes and read their books. But if you plan to meet them in person, make sure to bring a best friend in case you forget how to talk. Thanks, Sarah. <laughs>